Good morning, bird. Hi. Oh, he's so tired. Oh, uh, breakfast choice this morning. Good morning, sleepyhead. Hi. Did you sleep good? So I was only in mommy bed, daddy's bed for just this morning after daddy's alarm woke up. Huh. Did it go pee 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 pee? Pee 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 pee. <laughs> Can we take you out of the cupboard, big boy? Wah. Hi, mister. Is this a chunky belly, chunky belly, chunky belly? Why are you so big? Huh? You're so big. <laughs> you can come, you can go see mommy, you can go see sissy. Good morning. Good morning, baby. Hi. What do you see? You see Aspen. Hi, buddy. What are you doing? Hi. Aspen. Is it your doggy? <laughs> What's that crazy face? Ready to get your diaper changed? All ready for your dance class. Wow, you look absolutely gorgeous. Ooh, those are good twirls. What type of shoes are you gonna what type of shoes are you gonna wear? Your dance shoes? It does a little bit, but they're not supposed to twirl big because they can't get in the way when you're learning. Ooh. So, we are at Marilyn's dance now. Um, I'm really bummed because her dance and her swimming, you cannot like take pictures or film or anything like that. Um, I guess, I don't know, overprotective parents. I'm not sure there's big signs everywhere, which is really disappointing because like to me, swimming lessons and dance and stuff is like milestone stuff. And for me personally, I love to like capture that stuff in pictures. and video and you're not even supposed to take pictures so um 
kind of disappointing, but that's okay. So we are headed in right now to do her dance class and we'll check in with you after. We just got home and Braylon is cuddled up under her blankie watching some bubble guppies. And uh, it's kind of cold in the house and it's dark outside, so, and it was kind of cold when we went out. Um, so she's chilled a little bit. And then Paxton's down for his nap. So I'm gonna um, make some lunch for Braylon. It's 11.40, but she says that she's hungry for lunch. So I'm gonna start it and I'm sure by the time she attempts to eat it, it'll be like noon anyways. And so that's what we're doing right now. And then I need to do some just housework. Typical like mom day stuff. So Braylon is having today um, some watermelon, two carrots, and a ham and cheese sandwich for her request. So that is what she is going to have for lunch. So today I am going to have for lunch, um, I did a salad. So this is like 50, um, one of those 50-50 mixes of spring mix and spinach. And then um, I added one piece of like uh, sliced ham. I did a few cranberries. I got the um, light sprinkle of cheese. I actually added just maybe a pinch of peanuts on it. Um, the cranberries are those like salad cranberries. And then I actually have these crunchy, um, I don't know if you can see them, they're crunchy like jalapenos that go for your salads too. So I put that on there too, just a sprinkle of those. And then for dressing, I'm using um, zesty lime vinaigrette today. Um, so. And it does say great with avocados. It is delicious with avocados. Um, but that is what I'm having. And I was waiting on either just having like a hard boiled egg on the side or an avocado on the side. I'm not positive which one I want yet. So for anybody who obviously is friends with me on Facebook, but some of you aren't. Um, I can't even believe I'm admitting this. <laughs> I did it on Facebook because it's just friends and family. But I ripped my only pair of jeans that fit me. I have been not good about eating healthy or being healthy, especially since Paxton's been born. Um, I haven't lost my baby weight. With Braylon, I blinked and I didn't gain anything with her. I didn't even show with her. And then I actually even dropped lower than my pre-pregnancy weight with her. So totally different with Paxton. Gained a ton of weight. <laughs> and um, so it didn't fall off even though I breastfeed it didn't fall off so as of yesterday I was like that's it I'm putting my foot down I have no clothes that fit me and I've been refusing to go buy something because I don't want to buy a bigger size so <clears throat> starting today I had decided I'm going to be healthier eat healthier do everything Brandon's been really good about it lately he's like dropped inches and been working out and I just need to get on the bandwagon so hence the whole reason why I had a salad and I had had a healthy breakfast and um, when we went to the grocery store yesterday like I got rid of all the crap that like the bad stuff I didn't want to grab anything bad so I got a ton a ton a ton of produce which produce here in Washington sucks compared to California but that's okay we uh, figured it out so I'm excited and then I am a person who loves soda not um like Dr. Pepper or Mountain Dew but I love my Diet Coke and so it's more the carbonation that I crave and um so I'm totally like wanted to cut that out but I did cave in and get um it's gonna show you guys some La Croix? La Croix? Not sure what that is, but it's um, the natural passion fruit enhanced. It is sparkling water. So there is no like aspartame, no sugars, no absolutely anything because it's just carbonated water. Um, but it's cre like helping curb my carbonation craving because it's not really the soda that I crave per se as the carbonation I want the bubbly <clears throat> so I'm pretty excited about that and they had a couple different flavors but I grabbed the passion fruit huh yeah and so Braylon we decided together we're gonna eat a little bit healthier because I noticed she was eating a lot of sugar 
so she would have like granola bars and animal crackers and <laughs> different stuff like that and I would catch myself and be like wait a minute has she had a vegetable today so we're eating better today so she's had for lunch she had a better lunch today and not just a sandwich she had balance huh kind of get back on track and then need to get back on track on the exercising game I'm wondering maybe we might do some Zumba together in the living room huh because it is disgusting outside so we might do oh I got the hiccups so that's the problem with carbonation you get the hiccups but um I probably am gonna try and do some Zumba and I think Braylon would do some dance with me so I think that's on our agenda here in a minute I've been busy doing every mom's favorite task. Cleaning out clothes that are all too small and cleaning out closets because I think we are going to be having a huge garage sale. Um, I think I'm going to do it at my mom's house, but um, she's got like a huge driveway, which is really convenient. So hopefully there's nice weather. And um, I just have so much stuff to get rid of and move after move after move. You kind of accumulate even though you get rid of. And so it's just time. And this little girl is definitely loved and definitely spoiled. And she has stuff that she should be able to um, donate and um, to get rid of. And she's outgrown some stuff too. So we're going to have a garage sale. And he is eating mommy snacks. Oh, yum, 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 yum. Oh, yum, 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 Is it so good? Mom, you jump, you jump. 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 Jump, jump. Jump, jump. Jump, jump, jump. Hey, jump jump. <laughs> this is how you do this. There you go. Ready? Packs. Jump, jump, jump. No, I'm not talking to you. Move out of the way. Jump, jump, jump. Jump, jump, jump. Let me see those legs. Jump, jump. Jump, jump. There you go. Jump, jump. Jump, jump. Jump, jump, jump! <laughs> <laughs> afternoon organizing closets and 
now we are going to sit down for story time. We've had our bath. Oh, can you say hi, everyone? You're not supposed to chew your books, mister. So we're going to have a little story time. And then a little boo-boo. And then go to bed. What are you doing? Huh? What are you doing? You're not supposed to chew it. You're not supposed to chew it. What are you doing? <laughs> Say night night to everyone. Here. Ready? Put it down for a second. Say night night to everyone. Say good night. Good night. Hi. Say good night. We just read our stories, huh? We just read our stories. We did, and we. What did we do? We did our fighting book. We did our story book and our story. Yeah, Braylon loves her fighting book. Which fighting book did we do? A Shopkins. The Shopkins fighting book. And then we did a Tinkerbell story. Tinkerbell story. Tomorrow we have a baby shower for yeah. Auntie Daphne. And Grammy's, hmm, Grammy's dinner. I don't know if we're going to do Grammy's dinner now because Papa's working and Uncle Kai and Auntie Daphne have something to do. But maybe we'll just see Grammy, okay? And then we'll do her birthday dinner on a different day. We're going to Cassie's house. We're going to go to Auntie Daphne's house. And, and play with Casey's toys. Yeah. Okay. You got a mommy. Yeah. You what? Got a mommy. Does Case have a mommy? Yeah. Yeah. Yes, of course he is. What are you saying? And he have. He have animals too. Yes, of course he has animals. You can play with them. He got a mommy animal too. Yes, he does. <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, good night. You want to say good night? Okay, say good night, everyone. Bye. Bye.